Has anyone seen my gym bag? Yes, Albert, it's just here. Chuck it up for me. Off to the gym. in the house by myself! <laughs> Woo! That was tiring. Sorry for disturbing you. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. Whatever you're doing, whether it's brushing your teeth, eating some dinner, being distracted from your work. Welcome to the video. I do appreciate you clicking on the video and taking the time to watch this. And just before you start watching, or just after you've finished, I would appreciate if you hit the like button, you put a comment in the section below, you shared the video, you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, because I really do appreciate you guys doing that. And I've also recently set up a website where I sell powerlifting analysis packages, nutritional meal plans, as well as online coaching. I appreciate if you shared that website and check that out yourselves to see what you think and if you'd like anything. So as you know, I'm a personal trainer at the gym group, so I've been there this morning. I've also trained this morning with a friend back at home and I recently purchased an iPhone which is also linked to my personal training website and here is the iPhone in a sexy orange package package I mean case and this cost £1.99 brilliant eBay bargain and I think the postage was around a quid as well so I saved a lot of money there so it's a refurbished iPhone I got it for £140 and I'm just going to be using this to be able to contact clients when I get them online, but it's just a waiting game and you have to be patient, but I'm just gonna advertise myself online and on social media so a lot of people see it. And it was quite interesting the other day because I looked on Google Analytics and there's a lot of people from Russia who like to look at my website. Russia. Anyway, on to the food of this video. Let me just tell you what I've eaten already. So, so far to eat, I have had a banana. Mm -hmm. Two chocolate chip rice cakes, a chocolate and raspberry magnum, and a mocha which consists of a teaspoon of coffee and one Capri Highlights packet. 30 grams of Tesco cinnamon squares with 100 milliliters of semi-skim milk. And my couscous concoction which consists of 150 grams of couscous weighed out dry, Tesco everyday value chicken slices 120 grams, 235 grams of tomatoes, and a serving of tomato ketchup. So if you haven't noticed already, I'm rocking the Colossus Fitness Apparel. I ordered it recently. Thank you so much, guys, for sending me that. And do check out their channel if you haven't done so already. And check out their website. I've got this one and another top, which is... And this one. I put a picture on Instagram of these two tops recently. If you haven't checked out my Instagram, please go and follow me. It's at AFitness01. If you don't know, at the moment I'm just starting my cut. I'm gradually going into my cut and I was at 4,800 calories a day when I was bulking. I went down to 4,300 because my fat gain was going a little bit too high. And this week, from Saturday to Saturday, yeah, that's it, I'm going on three, no, sorry, 4,000 calories a day when I'm training and 3,700 calories a day when I'm not training. And I'll take you on to the next meal. The time is currently quarter past four and I'm just gonna be doing some uni work and I'm learning about aggression. So I'm gonna be doing that and then afterwards, I'm gonna eat something in around a couple, two, three hours and then I'm gonna bring you back once I'm eating that next meal. By the way, I had my couscous concoction in front of Quang Trang's 20,000 calorie challenge and I was so impressed, he can eat like a machine. It's 20 to 8 in the evening and it's time for round 2. A ding ding! Of my couscous concoction, which you guys should already know, off by heart, so recite it right now. I'm listening. No, you got it wrong, I'm just gonna have to show you again. He is what I have in the concoction. So just over here, I'm going to take the lid off and just be careful because music always plays when I take it off. As 
you may or may not know already, if you're new to the channel, in here I have Tesco Value Chicken Breast, Tomatoes, Couscous, and I also put tomato ketchup over the top. And I put this into the microwave at a power wattage of 800 for 6 minutes so the tomatoes go soft and it makes like a sauce with the couscous and the chicken and it tastes really good. So I'm probably going to eat this and whilst I was making this, I'm sorry, I'm going to have to admit it to you, but I did have a chocolate chip rice cake. Oh, 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 chocolate chip rice cakes in the house. See you at the next meal. Mm -hmm. Oh dear. <laughs> so the time is 10 minutes past 1 a.m. in the morning of the next day of eating. And I have got a confession to make. I had my dinner, after that couscous concoction, I had my dinner. I had some roasted salted peanuts and a bowl of Weetabix minis. And I completely forgot that I was doing a full day of eating. But I can still show you the food that I ate because it's just behind me, my dinner, and I can still show you the Weetabix minis as well as the peanuts. So follow me. For my dinner in here, we have got a beef stew and I picked out the beef pieces. I mean, personally, for me, when I'm cutting, I like to take the meat out of the sauce just because the sauce can contain quite a lot of calories. I know it's quite meticulous, but this is a cut. So if I was bulking, I wouldn't worry about that so much. But as I'm cutting, and I want to get the right amount of macros per day, then I am going to take the meat out of the sauce. But sometimes, if I can't do that, say I'm around a friend's house and they have meat in a sauce, then I would leave about 50, yeah, around 50 calories by the end of the day that are spare, just in case that sauce contained quite a few calories, and that means that I'm not likely to go over my caloric goal and my specific macros. In here, we've got potato, green beans, carrot, and broccoli. I had all of them within the meal, well, a tiny bit of broccoli. Here's the actual broccoli that I had. Over here, I had 100 grams of roasted salted peanuts, And I've had 130 grams of crispy Weetabix minis with 200 milliliters of Tesco semi-skim milk. And I've got roughly 500 calories left. I'm not sure about specific macros, but for the whole day, I'll put the macros on the screen at the end of the day. Hope you like my new hoodie. And as usual, I forgot to finish the video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please make sure you leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel and share it in that order. And check out my website if you haven't done so already. See if you're interested in... <laughs> Can't speak. See if you're interested in anything. Please be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Have a wonderful day and workout. And I'll see you in the next video. Zoom.